right, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to close out your uh, private browsing in your Safari uh, in iOS 15 and iPhone 12. So let's open Safari up, all right? So how do we get to private browsing? Well, you get to private browsing by going down to the bottom. If you pull this like this, it disappears. So you gotta kind of push it a little bit. Right now I have my address bar down here. You may have it at the top. But either way, it's the same. You're going to come down to these two little boxes. You're going to click them. Then what you have to do is, you know, it's got a couple windows on here. This has changed now in iOS 15, so got to get used to it. You're going to come down. You can see it's, I've got two tabs open, so I'm going to come down to two tabs, click it. And then there it is, private browsing. I just go like that. Now I'm in private browsing. Bam. Now if I want to look for something like, let's say, um, I don't know. Let's say uh, Google. All right, so I'm just gonna go to Google. I'm gonna let it open up. Now I'm in Google, now I can private browse. <laughs> All right, so let's say that I wanna get out of there, right? So a lot of people would just kinda go like this. And then they would go like that, and then they would go back to tabs. But I gotta warn you, if you do that, and somebody opens up as and you and you accidentally go back and open up your phone to private. Guess what? That tab's still open. So what you must do is whatever you looked at. Now I ain't saying you're looking at anything that you shouldn't be looking at, but whatever you looked at, make sure you close it out. Now it's gone. All right now I can go back. I can go to my two tabs. Now I'm back in the regular one. I hit done, or I could tap one of these, and I'm just back to my regular uh, browser. And that's how you close out private browsing. All right, if you like this video, subscribe to my channel. Check out my other awesome videos. Peace out.